Alright everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to be looking at a new ship. Brand new ship, one of two actually. Uh, actually it might be a little too small to call it a ship. But anyhow, I kind of think of it more like a cross between FaZe, Zipcraft, and Star Wars Advanced TIE Fighter. I'm a little reluctant to say that. Simply because everybody considers it to be like the Thai Advanced because uh, everybody calls it that. And it's kind of just basic at this point. But it does. It has a, it has some pretty hefty features of the Thai Advanced, so you can't deny that. Although Thai Advanced wings don't flippy flip. Anyhow, I think you know what we're talking about. We're talking about the uh, the Murai. Yuri. Uh, Mirai being a faction, I believe, of MISC. M-I-S-C. They definitely have very similar logos. And they're both based out of the same planet. Now, the thing about this ship is, it doesn't come with anything like the other SLFs do. The other ship watch fighters. So you're kind of left on your own as far as putting it in something that'll take it places. Everybody is standing at attention is creeping me out. Hi. Alright, let's walk on up here. So first things first, we gotta get this thing delivered back here because uh, I had a small problem at Port Olisar. Yeah, 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 we'll get that in a minute. I also want... Let's think about this for a second. I... <laughs> it fits on here? Let me tell you something. I was trying this earlier. This is interesting. It cost me, I, I have an idea of how to do this. All right, cool. We're gonna go ahead and claim this too. <laughs> 19 minutes. It will shorten it. I'll just wait the six minutes and I'll just do that. That way, both the uh, Fury and this will be back and I won't have to pay for the Fury and this will be cheaper. Anyhow, well, I'll be back when that happens. Actually, I'll be back when I'm looking at the Fury. All right, here we are. Wow. Oh, that is a really small little piece of equipment for this really big, huge box. But that's okay. Oh, I like that you walk up to it facing it. That's pretty awesome. So as you can tell, like it all folded up. This thing is teensy, as it should be, because it is a ship launch fighter. And as you can see, this is the reason why I think it looks a lot like a uh, cross between Faye Valentine's Zipcraft. And then when the wings are out, it looks like a tie advance from this angle, which you'll get to see that here in a little bit. But here it is on the ground, landed. I'll go ahead and open up the cockpit real quick, just to give it a little open look for a second. Open canopy. And then when you go to get into it, the seat comes down and everything. You'll get to see that here in a second. We'll go ahead and leave that open for a second and walk away. And we do have a couple of missiles and we have some guns. This version actually has guns. It only has a, a few missiles, not a whole lot. The other one is just packed to the brim full of missiles, but we'll look at that next week. And then we got power plant on the back, which we do have access to. If we hit this button here and it goes, woohoo! Oh yeah! And then we could pull it out if we had our uh, tractor beam on, which I don't, so I'm putting it back. And I don't want to pull it out anyway because I'm going to want to fly it here in a little bit. Of course, we are kind of killing a little bit of time here while we wait for the Corsair to cook. Yeah, we had to claim it, so it takes a minute. So, and we also have relays here. I think this is the radar, so I don't think... What, can we open that? We can open it. There we go. And boom. ba ba boom Component. And they're, they're all over this thing. Got a button here that opens one that opens this big huge thing. I think there's two in there. And then there's the same thing over here on this side. Big one and then little guy. Oh, and then the refuel. That might matter more for uh, like in-flight refueling, I think. Or maybe, oh, you know what? I know what that's going to have to do with. That's probably going to be something like... One of the ships that you can land this thing on will have a, a refueling station in it, I bet. And you'll have to hook the hose up to that. And that'll be kind of cool. So let's go ahead and uh, close this canopy back up real quick. And before we go hopping in this thing, we'll go ahead and take a look at the Urkel. 
Alright, here we are. So, on the weapons. Just jump right on in. On the weapons, we got four badgers. Not gimbaled. Which we don't need them, we don't need them gimbaled on us, the snub fighter. Never. Not, especially not on one like this. This thing is nimble. N -n 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 nimble. Like, oh my god, nimble. Like, if you're gonna land this thing in a ship, turn your speed limiter way down. It's the trick. I found it. I found it. Took a couple tries, by the way. <laughs> uh, anyhow, moving on. Well, we have zero quantum drive, no turret, no QED mining laser, none of that fun crap. We do have thrusters. We always have thrusters. Uh, 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 uh. I don't know what this is. It's locked that way, though, so it's, um... It's nothing. Moving on, we do have four Ignite 2 missiles. Man, size 2 on this little guy? Well, we do want to have some firepower. We have a, a lot of firepower on this thing. And this is, this ain't even the missile version. There's one that comes with nothing but these and a ton of them. But anyhow, the shield, we have the size 1 cloak. Stealth grade D. Is that, is that a D? I think it's a D. Let me, hang on. Yeah, D. And then for the power plant, we have a size 1 Roughneck, industrial grade D. I like how we go from a stealth grade to an industrial grade, but ooh, dokey. And for coolers, who cares? CIG, make me care about these, okay? Or don't, just get rid of them. Who cares? It is <clears throat> not for sale in game yet. The only way to buy one right now is to buy it in store and get it now because I don't know how long it'll stay in the store. Right now, here, let's go ahead and hop on over there. All right, so right now you can war bond it for 50 bucks, like money now, no credit, just money straight up uh same thing with the other one too and then for not war bond version that just own this thing outright and it's yours 55 bucks and if you have the store credit you can use that towards the non war bond but that's what they cost this, this is the only way to get it right now and i would not even be the least bit surprised if they take them out of the store like as soon as invictus is done <laughs> so Hop on it, if you want it. Back to the ship. Alright, welcome back. So, I, instead of hopping right on in, we're gonna go ahead and put it away real quick. And I think we've had uh, we've had plenty of time to let the uh, Corsair cook. So we'll go ahead and grab the Corsair. Take it out to somewhere where I can load this thing up pretty easily. And hopefully not destroy everything in the process. And then we'll take it out to go do a bounty, and hopefully, again, not destroy everything in the process except for the bounty. Wish me luck. Oh, I love this. This is amazing. Area 18, I have some very mixed feelings about you right now. Can I at least expedite? I can expedite it instantly. Let's do it. Good, good. We'll go ahead and store that. Retrieve. Hangar 5. We'll go to buy a genie point and we'll do it there. Shouldn't be too hard to do. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to leave the ship off. But when we get out, we're getting out via the elevator and we're locking this thing up. Because apparently, people want to be nosy. Hey, elevator. Oh. Huh. Sorry. Wrong button. Hmm. Nah, we'll get, we won't exit out the elevator. Or out the top. We'll exit out the bottom like a sane person. Oh, oh, that was scary. I don't know what... I mean, that's normal. I'm used to that. But the other thing, whatever that was, that was terrifying. Alright, let's go ahead and... <laughs> Close the is. That what? Does that not? He, oh, here we go. Return. Uh huh. -huh. It's a separate button. Okay. Cool. Just gonna go ahead and go over here and lose my mind a little bit though. While I slowly drift over towards the landing pad and hope I don't kill myself from falling too hard. 
What, what is that? I hear that. Who are you? Don't land there. Land on the other side. Why did that look like a vulture from, uh, from Elite Dangerous? <laughs> what ship in this game looks like a vulture from Elite Dangerous? I must be seeing things. Paranoia. What? Oh my god, there's way too much to think about there. Alright, then we come over here, and then we go ahead and click on this right here. Fury! Oh, claim. Just give this a quick little 40 seconds. Hopefully my ship is okay. It should be. I don't know what this is. If, I feel like it's over by Crusader. Hang on, before it kicks me out of the screen. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. Hangar 7! Oh, that's like... Ooh, they're almost- well, they're, they're in the same direction. They are about a thousand meters apart from each other, though. It's all good. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's tiny. It's tiny. It's tiny, teeny, tiny. Go to yeah. the other side. Let's get in, do the thing, and fly it for finally enter the pilot seat. Seat come out, and I hop in. Alright, we're finally making some progress here. We still have to not die. Doing some of the simplest things. Open the door. Thank you. Oh, this thing is twitchy. Oh my god, ship launch fighters, you're crazy. You're crazy. You're crazy, crazy, crazy. You move like the lightning. I love it, but I'm gonna die. Okay, let's go ahead and put our speed limiter on. Because we're going to need that. We're actually going to need need more than just it, but we're actually going to need to control it. Let's go ahead and put the lights on. Ha! Huh. Well, we're already pretty much at the Corsair, so... Did I really park that far away from that thing? No wonder it flew. Uh, it took me forever to fly so far. Alright, so here's how we're going to do this. First things first. I have to EVA. Stop moving. Stop moving. Let's we'll go ahead and turn the light off too. We don't need it on. We're going to go ahead and put this way down so that we don't like fly like into the ship. <clears throat> but first things first is we have the EVA out. So... If somebody starts shooting at my stuff... Because I hear guns. And it's making me nervous. Okay, where is... <laughs> Where is it? Where is the button? Push the button. Does it like tuck away when the landing gear's up? Okay, I have an idea. That's actually kind of nifty if it does. We still have access to this. And that is bright. Call the elevator. I'm skilled. Oh, okay. <laughs> this is very stressful. <laughs> is all of this worth it? We'll find out in the end. Oh man. We really need to go turning this on. As God. It's just so dark in here. I still- I think I still need my light on. Okay, maybe not for that. Open. Okay, Fury. Let's do this. Wrong button. Enter zero G. Somehow you do that <laughs> without using any jets. <laughs> okay, I think this is gonna be easier to do with the camera out here. And we'll go ahead just. Oh, I thought those lights were on. Oh, they're. Ball turret engines. Neat. Kinda like the Cartoal. <gasps> oh, 
Oh, why is the camera doing that? I don't like that. That's not fun. Stop doing that camera. I think we're in. Alright, shut the engine down. Hop on out. That went much smoother this time. It's a good idea to turn the speed limiter on and way down. <laughs> uh, close. Oh, yeah. Oh, I love it. I love it. It fits and everything. Mm. Just hope this time it doesn't crash. Because that was the problem we had before was we crashed. And that was not fun to crash. Please don't crash. I just want to do a mission. Just one mission. And then we might blow up. <laughs> Alright. Engine's on. Let's find some work. I will hug you and kiss you forever, Star Citizen, if we get this to work, I swear. Oh no! Oh. Oh, that's interesting. I did not expect that. Uh... Get away! No, no. No need for any of that. Although, I have an idea. Oh, I don't think it keeps... Mm. Crap! Well, let's try this. We're trying something crazy. Hop out. This ain't gonna work. Uh. Uh. Get up! Get up! Get up! Eh, it's alright. Trespassing. Whatever. Who cares? It, it, the ship is slowing down. It's probably stopped now. Fine. Open the door. We gotta do this. It would have been a lot better if I could have get the ship moving. I'm telling you. <laughs> okay, we're, we're still going to go ahead and go into this camera angle so we don't die. Haha. <laughs> okay, awesome. Is that... Okay, my Corsair is still going. Cool. <laughs> I think. <laughs> Alright, so that actually did work the way I wanted it to, I think. I'm not sure if I really wanted it to work that way anymore. Let's go ahead and put the landing gear down. No, wrong button. No, no. Let's try that again. I'm gonna put we're going to do it from this angle, since we're far enough away from the target and all, because we just kept going. Oh, okay, so we actually have to hit this button. Oh, I thought they flipped out. Well, that's fine. Actually, it looks pretty cool, too. I like it. I like it a lot. Well, let's go back and get that target. My ship is 11 kilometers away from me. I can't believe that worked. So we got four badgers. And they are not gimbaled. Well, that's the main guy. We do have a couple of missiles. Four to be exact. Which we could just go ahead and throw at him real quick. Well, that's the first guy. <laughs> How about you? You want to play? We are fast.
And we are nimble. Uh oh. Does that feel good? <laughs> Woohoo! Alright, I wonder if I can actually catch up to the Corsair. Uh if I could find it. I think it's gone. Yeah, it doesn't it's it's nowhere to be found. Can I find it this way? Oh, that's right. No, qu no quantum computer, so that's not happening. I can't believe how well that all worked. The only drawback is now I can't do the thing I originally wanted to do. But I have other options. And kill it. This might take a while considering, you know, this is a moon. Am I? Am I still going up? I am, aren't I? That's kind of funny. And my control surfaces do not work. I'm gonna turn that back on real quick. Bring that down. There we go. Now. Now it's just a matter of time. The planet's gravity will take over any second now. I think it already has. Well, anyhow, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, and come back for more. Transform! Transform back! Can I put the landing gear down like this? Oh, okay, so it just transforms into that. Ba boom ba bye, -bye.